action. Good afternoon, this is Dr. Philip Fowler with Anti-Aging Northwest again. Uh, today we're going to take a look at how to give a BPC-157 injection, uh, this time in the Achilles, near, near the Achilles tendon. Um, this is Dr. Beck, my colleague, and she is a runner and she injured her Achilles tendon. Uh, she's got a little bit of mild tendonitis there. She's had it for about two weeks and it's worse when anything pressure puts any pressure on it. So we're going to go ahead, we're going to do a, a BPC-157 injection near the insertion of the tendon on either side subcutaneously. So we're going to start by cleaning our injection site. And the volume of injection for BPC-157, which we reconstituted in another video, the volume for injection is going to be 0.2 milliliters, which is going to be 20 units on our insulin syringe, just like that. Okay? Now, subcutaneous. That means only through the skin. We are not going into a tendon. We are not going into a joint. We are not going into a muscle. We're going through the skin with a nice, small, and short insulin needle, and we're getting this product near the area that has pain. Okay? So we're going to go ahead and draw up our 0.2 mils. We're just going to go right in through the center of the rubber stopper there. Just like that, we're going to draw up 0.2 mils. Remember, we're measuring with the top of the black plunger where it meets the where it meets the syringe wall. Now, I'm going to make because I can in this area. I'm going to try to make a little skin tent by pinching, and then at the base of that skin tent is where I'm actually going to inject. This is it. bring that foot down just a little for me, doctor. Thank you. All right, and there it is. And we're just going to go right in and we're through the skin, through the dermis, not into any other spaces. And we're just going to inject and remove. We're not going to rub that in. We don't want it to move around a whole lot. Most injections I have you massage, but not this one. And uh, should be pretty painless. In another video coming up, Dr. Beck will show you how to do a self-injection in this area, which is a little bit tricky. We have a tiny bit of blood there. We're going to put a little pressure. Um, yeah, but Dr. Beck will show you how to do a self-injection there, and I'm going to be putting out some videos. I've been working on my knee with BPC-157, and we are going to take a look at how to do a self-injection in the knee as well. Thanks so much, and I hope everybody's having a great day.